Greetings everyone and thank you for joining us for this week's edition of GTV. I'm Don Valiant and this is the news from Kyungi Province this week. Kyungi Province has begun providing online information about free sanitary pad dispensers installed at public facilities in the province. This information can be accessed via the Kyungi Province website. Free sanitary pad dispensers have been installed at 225 locations in the province, including public buildings, subway stations, and libraries. Kyungi Province and Gimpo City jointly opened the first Social Economy Win-Win Shop, a promotional and sales outlet for social economy enterprise products at a large supermarket in Gimpo City. This shop was established at a Home Plus retail location through a social economy promotion contest organized by the Korean Ministry of the Interior and Safety. The province expects that these shops will help social economy enterprises with marketing and sales. Kyungi Province will significantly ease the qualifying criteria for economic independence doubling savings accounts for homeless youths. Introduced to help such youth secure economic independence through personal savings, this program provides matching provincial support for individual savings. The province plans to ease qualifying criteria so that more homeless youths can benefit, eliminating the personal income requirement and reducing the youth facility residence requirement to one year with the aim of implementing this initiative for 100 beneficiaries as early as next month. On December 27th, Kyungi Province opened a Regional Transportation Support Center for individuals with limited mobility at the Kyungi Transport Corporation. This center will undertake the management and coordination of associated services provided by cities and counties of the province. While the Regional Center oversees special transportation service program coordination and related policy improvement, Local centers will handle such tasks as vehicle scheduling and operation, service request reception, and personnel management. Kyungi Province has finalized the Kyungi Do Social Housing Basic Plan to supply 8,550 social housing units by the year 2026. Pursuing the promotion of communal housing culture as one of the core visions of the province, through the supply of Kyungi style social housing units, the province announced its basic plan that includes supply expansion through innovative methods and social housing supply in line with related welfare policies. This basic plan provides a foundation upon which Kyungi's annual social housing initiatives will be established and implemented. Last year, Kyungi Province's Design Sharing Program provided design development support to 40 enterprises and improved the environments at 13 public facilities. The Design Sharing Program, a provincial initiative, focuses on providing fledgling enterprises with design development support while improving the environments of public and welfare facilities. Last year's support activities included the improvement of rest facilities for medical personnel devoted to the fight against COVID-19 at Kyungi Provincial Medical Centers in the cities of Ansong and Weijongbu. Two local rivers in the cities of Suwon and Ichon were selected in the urban and cultural development categories of the Kyungi Style Clean Stream Project Contest. This contest, the first of its kind among Korean local autonomies, was organized by Kyungi Province to foster innovative spaces for improving local rivers as well as local economies. These two river projects will provide local development opportunities through the convergence of urban and river spaces in connection with local cultural and historical resources. Thank you for joining us for this week's edition of GTV. We look forward to seeing you again next week. Thank you.